Hi, my name is Mike Byrne, and I'd like to introduce you to a whole new concept in making coffee, which is called Café Depurato. Um, it's a process where coffee is brewed under vacuum, and it uses a special apparatus which has been specially designed for this purpose. Um, the coffee apparatus itself is several different parts. There's the main brewing vessel down here, there's a heater, um, in this case it's a special infrared heater. Um, there's the um, filter vessel here, and then the coffee is collected here. Um, this part on the side is a condenser for condensing coffee vapours and um, ensuring that the water is bringing the vapours back down into the coffee brewing vessel so nothing's really lost. Okay, well I'm going to show you how it works in a minute, so enjoy the video. So the first thing that we do is we grind the coffee. Um, I'm using a burr grinder here, which are generally preferred. Um, you don't need a really expensive grinder for this process because um, the extraction is much more even and much more effective. So even if you've got some coarser grains in there, it still gives you a very good extraction. Um, I'm grinding this on a setting of seven. It goes from one to 10, which is quite a coarse setting, but it's still relatively fine with this grinder. Um, you can also use espresso grind and that works just as well. That works very well in fact. I've just put in enough coffee here to make um, what would be equivalent of two shots um, espresso. Um, now this apparatus um, I can probably get in up to, well I've made six six shots of espresso in this in a single single time, um, but I can also make um, equivalent of about two to three cups of um, French press coffee in this as well, just by changing the ratio of coffee to water. So you're probably wondering why I've gone to the trouble of making a coffee apparatus which um, allows you to make coffee in the vacuum as much as anything. Um, well, I've found that if you can make coffee, um, brew coffee under reduced pressure um, by sustained uh, reflux, you're actually getting a coffee which is actually less bitter than it would be otherwise. Um, now, this completely flies in the face of all conventional methods of brewing coffee, which basically tell you things like in coffee percolators, for example, that you shouldn't boil coffee because it, you get a lot of tannins and bitterness. Well, by this process, that's just not true at all. So I normally brew the coffee for about two minutes from once it starts to boil. As you can see, once the coffee is brewed, any vapours can be condensed and returned back to the brewing vessel. Um, this also stops the uh, vacuum pump from being flooded, which would happen if I didn't have this part of the apparatus. Now, coffee is actually a very complex substance, and it's got a lot of different um, individual constituents that give it a wide range of flavours. Um, and I found that basically if you brew coffee in this way, so at reduced pressure and lower temperature, you're actually taking advantage of the reactivity of some of the, those constituents and you can remove a lot of the acids that are present in coffee and also a lot of the aldehydes. A lot of people also worry about tannins in coffee. Well, when you brew coffee under vacuum at low temperature and lower pressure, tannins actually are not very soluble. But they also have the benefit of reacting with a lot of the aldehydes in the coffee. So we can actually remove a lot of those aldehydes which are responsible for a lot of the bitter aftertaste that you quite often get in coffee. So in this way, we're able to remove a lot of the bitterness. Um, and the tannins themselves actually tend to remain um, stuck to the ground. So when we filter the coffee afterwards, we're actually removing a lot of those bitter compounds with the tannins and everything else. 
Okay, after two minutes reflux or so, um, the coffee is probably good to serve. Um, so you can then filter the coffee um, using these two taps at the top. Um, the coffee is then, um, most of the grounds will stay in the bottom and the coffee will make its way through to the top. And there's also an additional uh, filter at the top, built into the top of the equipment. Um, the coffee then collects in the middle and then it's all ready to be served out. So in essence, cafe depurato means purified coffee. It's coffee which has got less bitterness um, because a lot of those bitter compounds have been removed during the process. Yeah. I've just got um, half a cup of foam milk here um, and this is just one example of making a stunning cafe latte. Enjoy! Thank you for watching.